Hello my fellow YouTubers, I'm going to go ahead and show you a program that works kind of like Microsoft Office. Well, it works just as Microsoft Office and it's called OpenOffice and it's made by Apache. Now this is open source, it's free, and it's made to compete with Microsoft Office. We're going to go ahead and review it, take a look at it, and uh, take you through a couple of uh, tutorials on it. And on what I know, I'm not an expert with it, but we'll go ahead and take a look at it. Now I, I am at their website here and I will post a link on the description of the video below for this website here so you can go ahead and download it. Once you're at this website, go ahead and click right here where it says I want to download Apache Open Office. And then click on the green uh, a button here where it says download Apache Open Office. It'll start the download. Once you download and install Open Office, this is what it looks like here. I have all of the ones open. Now, their Word, similar to Word, is called Writer. And they have one called Math, which I haven't uh, mastered yet. I've just barely been looking at it. They have uh, Impress, which is the same thing as PowerPoint, or comparable to PowerPoint. They have Draw, which is comparable to like uh, Paint from Microsoft. I still haven't uh, figured it out that much yet. Because it looks, it kind of looks like PowerPoint in a way because you can actually add pages here, which is weird. And then they have Calc, which is uh, equivalent to Excel. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at Excel here. Now, it, it look, I mean, let's take a look at uh, <laughs> Calc here. Now, it looks a lot like Excel, actually. You can select um, different uh, blocks here. You can make formulas up here, same way as in Excel. Now the color, there should be a way to change color here, which I'm still trying to find. Here it is, and here's the background color and the text color. All right, so it's over here to the right. So basically, uh, it works the same. You just got to get used to where everything's at because it's a lot different than Excel. But it's free. Open Office is free, like I said. It's open source. But here's Excel. Now let's go ahead and take a look at Writer, which is almost the same thing as Word. And here it is. It's got all the fonts. It's got a bunch of fonts. Fonts, almost the same fonts as Word. Um, you can uh, center your text. Put it to the left, put it to the right, just like everything else. You can change the color over here on the right-hand side are more options. You can actually go to insert and you can insert hyperlinks, sections, headers, footers, bookmarks. And if you want to insert a table, it actually has a table uh, up here. You just click on table, click insert table. You can choose how many rows and columns. You can even name it. And bam, there it is. So you can insert tables just like in Word. It's got it. So it pretty much does everything that Office does. It's just the buttons are different. Where everything's at is a lot, lot different. Of course, as you notice, there's no Office big old button here. All right, everything's just there. Uh, it has file print preview, or page preview is what they call it. Everything's there. Um, they have printer settings. Here you can change whatever printer you're using. All right, so so everything uh, is a little bit different, but it does the same exact thing as Word. Let's take a look at more here. Now, like I said, there's the math here. I really don't know how to use it. I admit it. I don't know how to use this. I'm still trying to figure it out. If you guys know how to use it, I want to give you give um, give everybody on YouTube some tips. Go ahead and comment on the comment section below, at least on how to get started, like make a formula or make a an equation, you know, work something out, work some numbers out, subtraction, multiplying, dividing, anything of that. Let us know how to do it. I'm still trying to figure it out. I am going to look at uh, the help section on here and uh, see how to use it. All right. Now let's go ahead and take a look at Impress, which is this equivalent to PowerPoint. Just like PowerPoint, you could just right click right here and new slide. You can select a new slide. Um, you can go to insert. You can go in and insert table, movie, and sounds, which you can. Uh, it'll take you to look for them. 
and if you want to look at the slideshow you actually click on slideshow up here click on slideshow and you can start looking at it and by clicking or hitting the space is how you change slides okay it should be the same thing as PowerPoint correct me if I'm wrong all right let's take a look at the tools here we have media player customize So it looks like they have templates. All right, and like I said, I'm, I'm I'm still trying to figure out how to use all this, okay? But as I can see here, pretty much uh, does the same thing as PowerPoint. You just got to find where everything's at. And here it gives you what's cool is it gives you an option here. You can insert table, insert picture, insert movie. Or insert a chart, so it gives you the it gives you the the option there, and you can it just works just like PowerPoint. It almost looks the same. Now remember, this program is free; you don't have to pay for it. So that's what's awesome. And it looks like there's one more on here that I uh, forgot to open, and it's called Base. Now I suspect this program is exactly the same as Outlook, but don't but don't uh, quote me on that. It's got something to do with database. It might be like Outlook. I, st I still got to look at it. If you guys know exactly what it is and how to use it, go ahead and comment on the comment section of the video here. But uh, that's pretty much it. This is Open Office. Like I said, it's free, and um, it's awesome. Man. If you if you learn how to use Open Office, oh, one thing I forgot to uh, to show you guys here is that uh, Writer. Open Office Writer can actually open Word documents. So it'll it will open up Microsoft Word right here 97 from 95 all the way up. It'll open it. Listen, there is some old Microsoft Word files too. So here's 2003, 2007. So Open Office will open uh, Microsoft Word documents. All right, so you can actually use it for your Word documents. And like I said, it's it's free, it's open source, and uh, I really like Open Office. I'm gonna go ahead and keep it on my computer just in case. I do have Office Starter, which does not come with PowerPoint. So if you're looking for uh, to save money and get everything uh, for free, I recommend getting Office Starter. And I have a tutorial. I will post a link for the tutorial on this video for Office Starter and Office Starter is for free and it comes with Word and Excel but it does not come with PowerPoint so if you get Office Starter and you download Open Office then bang perfect you have uh, PowerPoint which is you know not PowerPoint it's called Impress but it, it's the same as PowerPoint almost you just gotta get used to it and uh, that's the way I'm doing it um, you know I'm not paying for the home student or the business you know it's, it's just to me it seems too much you could just do it the way I showed you right now using Open Office and Microsoft Office Starter. All right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. If you subscribe, I'll subscribe back to your channel, like always. And uh, thanks for watching. Have a good rest of your day.